One of them spy ninjas, me and Melvin are fighting and I don't know why. Then leash at the stalker! He played a moment with us and I never trusted him after that. You're just being suspicious. No, you're suspicious for bringing strangers to our house. You don't know how to open up. Ah! Oh. Ah! 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 Hey, what the, what's going on? What are you guys fighting about? What the heck's going on here? He's trying to bring the stalker over here, Chad. The stalker that stole our date fund. He stole my launch pad. He stole all of our stuff. He hates me. And we don't even know who this guy is. He's coming. We're here right now. And he's making Melvin act this way towards us, the spy ninjas, his family? Uh, Melvin, calm down, okay? You just need to understand where V's coming from. The safe house is sacred. It's our home. We can't just invite random people over. He's not random. He's my friend. Okay, Melvin. I know he's your friend, but he's not our friend. I don't feel comfortable with him coming to our safe house. You're not the safe house, dude. Then let me just arrange a meeting with him at the park. And then you guys can see for yourself that he's my buddy, my Fortnite bro, and he's not the stalker. Okay, Melvin, yeah, you go to the park, meet the leak. We've got your back just in case anything happens. And we're gonna figure out if this guy truly is the stalker. I'll get you next time, V. Okay. Okay, Melvin, we are at the park now. We gotta find your buddy, the leak here. This is gonna be a sting operation, Melvin. You're gonna go up and talk to him. We are gonna spy on him. I don't know why I brought the night vision goggles, but here you go, Daniel. Regina, put on this headphone and microphone. Cool. It's Bluetooth. Melvin, put in these AirPods. We'll be in your ear telling you what to say and listening to you as well, because he's have a microphone. I don't feel good about this. Melvin, you gotta tell the leak to meet you here. He's still on the way to the safe house. Yeah, I'm gonna give him a call right now. You know how weird it is to meet people IRL? No, it's not. It's not weird at all. Hey, leak. Yeah, what's good? I'm at the park right now. Where are you at? I'm on my way to the safe house. I'm here instead. Yeah. I'm at the park nearby. I'm wearing green and looking fresh. What are you wearing? Uh, I'm wearing orange. Just hurry up. Something crazy happened last night. Just me. All right. Well, I'll, I'll see ya. Something crazy. So Par partying last night or what? We gotta set up the sting operation, boys and girls. We gotta pick a hiding spot because he's gonna be here any second. All right, Melvin. Good luck, man. Bye, Melvin. You got this, bro. Keeping an eye on you. Where are you gonna go? The bird watching station right here. Well, usually there's some binoculars on here, but that's okay. Oh, oh my wow, God. Jeez, oh, I brought the binoculars this time. Still I'm so excited to see who Melvin's friend is and what he looks like. Where'd that come from? You brought that with you? I brought this with me, man. What? You never know when you gotta do some hacking, right? Exactly. Melvin's gonna be getting information out of the leak. I can look up stuff about his... self. There's somebody approaching Melvin up there. Oh my goodness. Melvin, come in. Get ready, someone's approaching. Spy ninja's acting all sus. Won't let me have my own friends or freedom. Guess I just have to hang out here. Wait, oh. Here it comes. Wait, that's the leak? Wait, he said he was wearing orange. That's gotta be him. That is him. Okay, cool. This is going whoa, perfectly. Whoa, 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 wait a second. I recognize that dude. What do you mean? What do you mean? He was part of that fight club. Melvin, watch out. That's the dude from the fight club that we fought. Oh. What's going on, man? Long time no see. Leak, how you doing? Is that, is that really you, Leak? What's up, man? Yeah, it's me, dude. You looking good, man. Thanks. Um, you too. This guy beat you up, Melvin. He's not your friend. You can't trust him. I knew it. I knew this guy was a stalker. Want to sit down? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Let's do that. Does he look like the Walmart guy? It is the Walmart guy. You're telling me the Walmart breakdancing guy is the same as the Fight Club guy? What about the skating rink guy? It's all him. The same guy. Me and Regina got to the bottom of it yesterday. Yes. You guys saw it, right? Gosh, look at these mysterious vehicles driving by. Okay, I changed my mind. Maybe this guy really is the stalker. Yesterday, after we talked, I got on my skateboard. I must have hit a rock or something because I fell off. I woke up in a Tesla. Okay, wait a second, it. Leak. You were part of the fight club. You clearly knew it was me. You are a hectic pretty sus. They, they told me don't say anything. Just show up at the park and just fight. At least that can confirm that you're not the stalker. All this talk about this stalker, man. It's, it's a little hot, bro. Hold on. Jeez. I think the pieces are aligning. Yeah, it was getting hot. I had to take off my shirt. But he's showing off his teeth. Sure. You know, if you make a really small hole, you can like see it more more focus really far away. That's true. This guy's not the stalker. He's wearing a Taco Bell shirt. He's cool. Do you see the design on his shirt? It's Taco Bell. Yeah, it's awesome. No! It's almost as awesome as this design. No! The shirt, his design, it has triangles on it. Look at it. We've seen that before. Remember from the movie theater? <gasps> triangles. Right. This rings a bell. A Taco Bell. 
Thanks for laughing at my joke, Daniel. You're goofy. Guys, focus on the mission here. This guy must be missing a chunk on his shirt. This is the chunk right here. If we can prove that he's missing a piece, then he's definitely the stalker. Melvin, look to see if he has a hole in his shirt. <laughs> my... My gauge is just loose, you know, I just gotta... <laughs> wow, what a cool design on your Taco Bell shirt. Oh, you like this? Yeah, yeah flex got, it, bro. It's got like uh, some squares over here and some uh, pyramids. Excuse me? Circles right over here. Try to look at the back of the shirt. That might be where the hole is. You should, um, you know, strut your stuff. All right, sure, yeah, yeah I mean... Is there a design on the back? Uh, no, it's blank. Let me see that tag on the back, then. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's all right. You can... We, no. Oh, there's something very suspicious about this guy. Why wouldn't he want to see the back of the shirt? It's because he has a hole in the back. We gotta get a closer look or something. We'll have Melvin lead him over to the slides. B, we can use her stealthy sneaking skills to go through the tunnel slide and look at his back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good idea. I can't see the back of the shirt. You were really the guy that held the board for that weird buff guy? <laughs> Why don't you show me that exact same thing? The park's right over here. Okay, Melvin's doing it. Okay. You're the small one, go. Hand V the camera so she can see his shirt. V, take the camera. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna come down. <laughs> oh, I'm sliding. <laughs> oh no. Okay, this is not working. This tunnel slide's too slippery. Dang it. You go up and take the camera with you this time. Then it'll work yeah, better. Yeah, they're coming, they're coming. Oh, okay. Let's go. The stairs. Hiding guys. Well, Daniel by the trash, of course. What about the other dude with the mask? Okay, guys, Melvin and the stalker is right down there. I'm gonna use the slide here. I'm heading towards the slide. Very close to Melvin and the stalker. Okay. Yeah, but. What should we do? Uh, tell him to d distract the leak somehow. Hey, Melvin, come in. Distract the leak. Um, it's just, it's just the way the cookie crumbles. Oh, I like that song. Just the way, <laughs> way the, the cookie, cookie crumbles. crumbles. And then you take the cookie and you split it in half. Yeah, I keep saying that part. Take a little bite. That's the way the cookie crumbles. That's a cool song. But I gotta try again. I guess I'm going head first. See, bro, we got so much chemistry in real life, man. All that gameplay, dude. Yeah, it yeah. translates well. Oh no, he just fell down the slide. The leaf's onto her. Hey, Melvin. Teach him some We should teach him something else, like right now. We'll teach him how to uh, do something. Did you get a look at the back of his shirt? Did you see a hole missing? No, they moved. There was an acorn in the way. Cookie song. That gives me a good idea. Oh. Hey, guys, I have a good idea. Take a time coming. We gotta throw these to make the rock turn around. And then we can see the back of his shirt. Okay? Good thinking, good looking. Let's go. Dude, I know exactly what we should teach Chad. What? We should teach him how to sew, man. Why? Because he's always got like rips in his jeans, man. Like, is he having a hard time? <laughs> no, I think that's the trend. Hey, Melvin, why did you move? Bring him back to the twisty slide. We got a plant. Acorns. Acorn? Yeah, yeah. Have you heard of tinnitus? Tinnitus? Yeah. Just Let's just move on back this way. Okay. <laughs> let's backpedal. Tinnitus, dude, how do you know all these terms? He's back, he's back. Throw the acorn, Jen. That Fortnite video was pretty... What was that? Regina, toss, toss, toss. You know what they say, a corn a day keeps the doctor away. <laughs> these are pine cones, not acorns. <laughs> Why does everybody call these acorns? Oh, really? <laughs> well, you guys know these are pine cones, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Ow! Shoot, shoot, shoot. Ah! Get him, get him. <laughs> Why are you just like nailing them with acorns? I think V's got a good look at the back already. Guys, clearly there's no holes in his shirt, so he cannot be the stalker. So who is it? Chad, no! Ow! Ouch! <laughs> Something's really weird, man. Yeah, something is really weird. Babe, did you see the shirt? There's no holes in his shirt, but I'm still pretty sus of him, though. Those Taco Bell shirts are a dime a dozen, that's what they say. <laughs> you never heard that slang? No. It's a cool, it's a cool hit That's slang. That's some cool term. slang. It's, it's cap. <laughs> I know exactly what to do. Do you like to swing? Whoa. <laughs> yeah, <bro. laughs> I'm talking about... 
Swing set! You're a comedian, I tell you, dude. Can you hold this for me? Uh, yeah, sure. There's his wallet right there. And we gotta figure out if this guy truly is the stalker or not. We need some evidence. We need hard evidence. He stole our date fund. There was $150 in that box. Okay. That's Melvin. Melvin, how much money is in there? If you can tell, uh, my leather gloves are a genuine leather. How much you buy those for? A lot. Oh, They're uh, cashmere line. Cashmere? Let me see. How much were these? I only have 150 bucks you... in my wallet. I don't, I don't think I can afford those. 150 dollars! 150 exactly! He has the same shirt, he has 150 dollars! Gotta be the stalker! It all matches up! The leak is the stalker! Man, I can't even buy cool cashmere gloves like you, dude. There's no point. Wait, wait a second. <laughs> Peace out, wallet. You almost got me. Maybe we should get off the swings and move elsewhere. I'm gonna do a super cool trick. Oh my gosh, bro! bro. Oh, oh. oh my gosh, he just wiped on the swing set. <laughs> <laughs> he fell on his booty. Oh my gosh, I ruined my trick, dude. My brand new shirt. Is it scuffed? Is it dirty? Can no. I still return it later? Guys, you know what though? Just because you have $150 doesn't necessarily mean you're a stalker. We need more <gasps> evidence. Is there any way you can like track his heartbeat remotely through the night vision goggles? To track somebody's heart rate, you need a really amazing piece of technology, not a piece of... <gasps> Oh, what? Oh, what is it? What is it? Oh, oh. whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the Apple Watch has a bunch of different apps on it, uh -huh. including the heart, heart rate, rate sensor monitor. Sensor. Sensor. Well, both are correct. You got 118 beats per minute while wow, you're excited. Dude. I'm nervous. Are you nervous? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, oh gosh. He needs this exact Daniel Gizmo lie detector Apple Watch. He needs this one. Well, how are you going to get that on the leak? <sighs> I don't know. What if I just put it somewhere and he finds it? Ooh. Free Apple Watch, I think I'll take it. Oh, he'll probably take it. Oh, yeah. He took my money, so... Ah! Since I love throwing acorns so much, I mean pine cones, we'll take this, wrap it on a pine cone. Wow! From the sky, aliens deliver free presents. It's cool. No, oh. dude, that thing's gonna break! No, it won't! Not if it lands in the grass. Oh. If it hits him in his big bony head. Oh, Chad, this is... Oh, my gosh. Hey, look, it's the size of your wrist. Hey! Oh, you're gonna... Oh, this is this is so oh, weird. That, that's gonna be perfect. Oh, that's Daniel. Don't, I see it. I see the resemblance. Don't break it, dude. Oh! oh. Chad! Just get in it throughout you. Oh, gosh. <laughs> You're such a prankster, Chad. I was voted best prankster. Okay, fine, I'll do it for real. <laughs> oh, man. I threw that one high. <laughs> that was pretty gnarly, right? dude. You took a big fall. Oh! Dude, something just hit me. Oh! oh. You, you got it right in the shoulder. <laughs> yeah. Good aim, Chad. Whoa, what is this? An acorn with a watch attached to it. Where'd this come from? Melvin, tell the leak that the aliens sent the watch. What? That he has to wear it. Uh, the aliens. It's a sign from the aliens. You're right. What, what do you think we should do with this? You should uh, wear it. Should we be watch buddies? Maybe watch brothers. My laptop's right over there. I'm gonna go grab it, hook it up to the Apple Watch, and measure this guy's heart rate. Wrist check! Wrist check! Wait, is, are you pulling in like a horn, like a truck horn? Like No, two, two? it's just one, just one boom check. I don't boom? know. I won't, I won't make any noise. Ready? Wrist check! Boom! Oh shoot, I messed up. You're supposed to say wrist check. Melvin, take him for a walk over towards by the bird watching station. I've, I've never owned a watch before. Usually when I want to tell the time, I just look at the sun. Why don't I teach you how to use that new thing uh, back at the table? First I get hit with an acorn in my head, and now another acorn hits my shoulder, but this one has a watch to it. This might be my lucky day. Aren't you glad you met me here at the park? Okay, there's a laptop, Daniel. Here's my laptop. It's time to do a Bluetooth lie detector test. Ooh. Oh, you upgraded. <laughs> Oh, hey, Daniel. Oh, Good job, Daniel. All right, so I can wirelessly connect to the Apple Watch, pull up the lie detector test application. I'm reading his heart right now, his pulsating heart. Pulsating Whoa. Heart. That's not what I meant to You're say. Pro. I'm measuring his precipitation. Whoa. Uh, what? His perspiration, <laughs> I mean. Has this guy lost his lie detecting skills or what? The shirt, man. It's not working. All right, tell Melvin we're hooked up and, uh, just ask some questions to prove if the leak is the stalker. Melvin, Melvin, we're hooked up. We okay, start by asking him something just conversational, like a friend would ask. Nothing too obvious. Yeah. Oh, we know that this stalker likes Baby Yoda and Bob uh, Ross. Yeah. yeah. Ask the leak if he likes Melvin. Hey, do you like me? Do I like you? 
Yeah, of course I like you, man. We play video games together. No, no, no don't, don't do, do that. that. Ask the league if he likes Bob Ross and Baby Yoda. Hey, do you like Bob Ross and Baby Yoda? Bob Ross? Like, the store Ross? Oh, he thinks he's talking about the store Ross. <laughs> Where they sell discount clothing. Baby Yoda? Yeah. This is the way. I think that's what they say, right? That's what Baby Yoda says? I don't know what he says. I don't know anything about Star Wars. No, it's Star Trek, man. Guys, come on, help me out here. I'm not getting any valuable information right now. We don't know if he's the stalker. Ask him how he feels about me. Ask him how he feels about the queen. The tiniest spy in charge. The spiciest. Oh, oh and the sassiest. Oh, oh, oh. I know you you know about the spy ninjas, right? Mm -hmm. You know about all of them. Yeah. How do you feel about V? I've never met her personally, but she seems like a pretty nice person, and if Chad likes her, then I like her too. That's really good news. All our fans love V, and I don't know why. What's her favorite color again? Yellow. He likes you, V. So he can't be the stalker if he likes V. The stalker keeps crossing V's face out and doesn't seem to like her. Is he lying or telling the truth? Oh, yeah. That's the whole point of this lie detector thing. Shoot, the reception's kind of bad. I gotta well, get a, a little closer, I think. You're so rusty at this, you don't even know how to do it anymore. I've never done Bluetooth lie detecting. I think we should just ask the question we've all been waiting for. Melvin! Melvin! Ah! Sorry. She's the tiniest... Ah! Uh, <laughs> Melvin, just... Ask him if he's the stalker. Okay, look, Leek. I'm gonna be real straightforward here. You're acting super sus. And you're quite weird in real life. I'm trying to prove your innocence to the spy ninjas. And you're making it really difficult to. With the fact that you're a part of the fight club, you have your own encounters with this weird stalker guy. So I just want to know, are you the stalker? Whoa, whoa, am I the stalker? Bro, you, you asked me this tons of times already. Dude, how many times do I gotta tell you? Whoa! Uh-oh. He's getting angry, he's getting mad. He's insulted now. He's getting defensive, though. You know what? Ugh. How many times do you want me to answer this question? I already told you. Alright, sorry, sorry. My sorry, swagger! Sorry, sorry. He threw stuff at Melvin! He's mad! What's going on with his heart rate, Daniel? I mean, he's moving around a lot, so like, once you move around, you know the rules. You move your fingers, inconclusive. True. Mel Melvin, it may calm him down. Make him stop moving his fingers so much. After all the times that we played together, and we had victories together. Are you serious, Melvin? Are you crazy? Daniel, what's that noise? Is that your phone? It's your phone, Daniel. Okay, what? Okay, it's, what's it's, all this notification? It's fine, it's fine. Don't worry about it right now. Who's texting you? Yeah, focus on the mission. I'm yeah. sure it's, it's probably just a random notification. Can't believe you would accuse me of this situation. Notification? Daniel, why is he looking at his watch? Wait, wait, wait. It's what, 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 the same noise. <gasps> Is that's your watch? Shoot, my phone is synced up to my Apple Watch. I just got a, a foot long notification and oh, he, he's gosh. reading it right now. Oh, foot long? So are you serious, Daniel? What is this? Coupon for a five dollar foot long sandwich. That's a great deal. Five dollars foot long. You ever eat at Subway? I love their spicy Italian. Wait, Wait why don't we go to Subway right now? <laughs> Wait. He's connecting the dots, I think. Oh, he's smelling oh, he's my... smelling... Oh, no. Sauerkraut or baby powder? I don't smell like anything. Blue, Apple Watch, Footlongs, this is Daniel's watch! Are you setting me up? No! No! What, no! He just said Daniel's watch! No, it, okay, it, anybody can have a blue Apple Watch yeah, and sign up for Footlong on a vacation. Can't prove it. He knows, guys, wait. this is bad! Wait, he, he's, go, he's tapping the Apple Watch. What's he doing? <gasps> oh! Oh! Ah! Ah! You hear that? They're right there! Dude, you set me up, bro! Whoa, what? I don't even know if I can trust you anymore. Bleak, it's not like that. I'm out of here, bro. Bleak, no, no, no. We gotta get him. We gotta get him. Go, go, go. That's the stalker. Here's your phone. Get him. 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 Bleak, it's not. It's not like that. Bleak, it's not like that. I didn't yeah. mean it. I didn't. Oh. 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 You okay, man? Hey, you okay? Hey, hey, hey. You're the stalker. We know it. Yeah, we know it. I'm not the stalker. You guys are the stalkers. You guys are setting me up. Wait, we just wanted to find out once and for all that you're the stalker, and it looks like you are, buddy. I'm not the stalker. I'm telling you, I'm not. Every time the stalker's doing stuff to us, you're not around. And then when you are around, the stalker stops texting us. You know what? I got a good idea. How about we get the stalker and me in the same room, and I'll prove my innocence to you guys. That would prove your innocence. How are you going to do that? It sounds like we need to go on a mission together. You trust this guy to go on a mission with us, Melvin? Let him prove his innocence and take him on a mission.
He's fine and just we found our stalker and he's right over there. See, I told you it wasn't me. He's right there. We need to get this guy and confront him today. We should follow him. He's walking away. Come on, come on. This does not prove that he's the stalker and you're not the stalker. He's just a guy in a trench coat. Man, we live in Las Vegas. Who the heck's wearing a trench coat nowadays? If you don't know, this is the leak. This is the guy that's supposed to be Melvin's friend who played Fortnite with Chad. I mean, I'm still kind of a little sus of him. He said he's not the stalker, so he's helping us out. Today, we're going to prove if you're the stalker or maybe this other weird guy's a stalker. How do I know that you guys aren't working together? What if you're luring us to a trap? right now a trap i would never do such a thing i love the spy ninjas what he's on his phone who do you think he's talking to i don't know oh i think you guys should use some of your gadgets wow you are a fan here's the ninja noise enhancer extend that microphone v i told you i can get mannequins all day that's not a problem just as long as you hold up your end of the bargain i gotta go He's talking about mannequins? Hold your end of the bargain? See, I told you it wasn't me. If it was me, then I would be on the phone with him. What do you know about mannequins? Um... Isn't mannequin used to be like a dance or something? And aren't you a dancer? What's the mannequin dance? It's like this. He's walking, come on. You're, you're distracting me. Oh, oh, there he is, there he is. Go to the restrooms. Restroom? <gasps> Never film in a restroom, so you can't bring the camera in there, okay? I'm gonna go in there and check things out, okay? Oh my gosh, he's so brave. I can't believe he's going in there. We're all brave. All the spine ninjas are brave. That's right, you're the bravest one of all, right? <laughs> yeah! So what do you know about the stalker guy? All I know is that yesterday I was on my skateboard and I fell off, knocked myself out. When I woke up, I was in the back of a Tesla. <gasps> I was in the back of the Tesla too. What? Tesla high five. I just went in there. He's not in there. Was there a window in there? There's only one stall. There's no windows. I don't know how he got out of there. This guy vanished. Maybe through a vent or something. Oh, look at this, guys. This is how we're going to find him. Grab those engines. Show him a trick, V. No hands? Oh my gosh. Dude, you guys are freaking talented. Watch out, boom. I can do the running. Oh my kick. gosh. Woo! Here we go. Whoa. Oh, I'm dangerous. Wow, dude. Watch out, watch out. Are you okay, man? You guys got insurance, right? Okay, guys. How are we gonna find him? We gotta think back to everything he's ever told us. Maybe there's some clues in there on how to find him. There's something about a mannequin. That's when you started doing your mannequin dance. And he left a mannequin at our house. He loves mannequins or something. There's lots of mannequins at a mall. He must have stole the mannequin from the mall. Or maybe he works at one of these stores at the mall. Okay, guys, we gotta find the store where he took the mannequin from. Where can we find a mannequin? In this trash. You guys always find stuff in the trash, right? Oh my gosh, no! Oh my gosh, dude. You okay? I, don't, I didn't find any mannequins in there. Is that what they're called? Mannequin? I say mannequin. Mannequin. I don't know. I think it's pronounced mannequin. That thing at the park is definitely an acorn, right, Leek? A corn a day keeps the doctor away. An acorn? Yeah, that or a pineapple. Oh, there's another trash can right there. Vivi, Vivi, come here, come here. Why is he in the trash? Did you ever notice how every time that stalker guy's around us, he's like doing something distracting, like dancing or something, or like, hey guys, look at me. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah. I don't know what he's looking for in there. Yeah, this. I mean, he's looking for a mannequin or something, but... He's definitely sus. sus. He should be ejected, Chad. How are we going to find the store that has the mannequin in it, okay? The directory. It's definitely a female mannequin, right? So we got to look for a woman's shopping store. There's so many of them. How do we choose which one? The greatest of all letters is a C, right? For Chad? All right, let's just try one of the C's. Let's try Charlotte mm -hmm. Ruse. But that's a girl store. We can't go in there. Oh, hey, we got a girl. Okay, you want this straw? No, no thanks. You can keep it, man. You put it in your mouth. Aha! Look who it is. It's Charlotte. Look at the mannequins. Don't they look like the one that was sent to the house? Look what? at their toes. I can't spread my toes that far. Whoa! Uh, are you distracting us again? I can't. I can't oh, spread gosh. it that oh, far. Oh, I don't want to see that. Okay, I'm going to go in. You got to go in there. You, you just deal with him. Okay. All right, all right. Ooh, what's wrong with your feet? They oh, stink. Sorry. We were just on a high-speed chase on those motorcycles, man. You made that they stink. This is what it's like to do missions all day? It's, it's exhilarating, This bro. is what it's like to be a spy ninja, yes. Oh, here's V. <laughs> Sneaky spy ninja. What first the clue is V? Do the mannequin dance. <laughs> She's doing it. Well, that one mannequin is really cool. She's really cool. She's checking the pockets. That looks like my jean jacket. Wait, 
Whoa. What the heck? Oh, seriously? What is it? Wait. Oh my gosh, what look at that. Heck is that. It's symbols. Come on here. This totally means that that guy, he must have got the mannequins from here. Or he goes shopping here or something. And the jean jacket. What the heck? Dude. And this is the Project Zargo language. Oh my gosh. And look, he's trying to frame me too. Orange, orange. Interesting choice of words. Maybe you guys are working together. You gotta decode this, man. That way I can prove my innocence. Spy Ninjas, if you can decode this for us and leave it down in the comments. You know, the last time we found a clue, it was diamond equals S. So if you set your decoder wheel, set the diamond to line up with S, the rest of these should line up up. Hopefully you guys can decode that for us and let us know what it says. Okay, we're making really good progress to finding out who this stalker is, guys. I feel like we might have found that stalker already if, you know, that guy wasn't with us. He does keep distracting us. I mean, right when I was about to find a clue in the jacket, he told me to do the mannequin pose. Sus. True. He was trying to distract you from finding it. Do you think the leak is the stalker? Or do you think it's the trench coat guy? We could be working together. Maybe it's a team. He's gotta be inside this ball somewhere. We gotta look around. I just got a message. It's a picture of that Joker thing. Okay, so it's the stalker. He must know we're on his tail. It says, eat a Cinnabon with no hands and I'll show myself. Oh, man. I like Cinnabons though. Okay, well every mall's got a Cinnabon, right? All right, let's give it a shot then. Daniel's Jewelers. That must be uh, where Daniel's gonna get his uh, new wife a ring or something. She doesn't even know her name. You what? gotta get her name, you gotta be close with colleagues first, what? and then girlfriend, and yeah. then wife. Let's and get the Cinnabon, there's some escalators here. Leek, look, that's the guy. Yeah. Right there. Right there. Right there. Watch your step. This guy keeps disappearing. This guy's a magician, man. Where's he going? Magician. Do you know him? I don't know any magic except this. You see that? I mean, my thumb disappeared. Wow, that's really something. That's really great. No pause? All right, this guy's definitely not the stalker. Cinnabon's up this way. Let's go. Cinnabon. Let's get it done. Wait, wait. How are we going to decide who's going to eat this thing without their hands? Maybe the leak can. I'm on that new uh, vegan diet where I can't have any Cinnabon or Bonds or Cinna. I know how to do this. Check this out. I believe in you. I will do one Cinnabon, please. One Cinnabon? Anything else for you? Nope, just the one. All right, thank you. All right, Cinnabon time. Where do we eat this at? Look at these cute cards. Oh my gosh, look. They got Melvin's color, Regina's color, your color. <laughs> uh, can you fit? Oh my, oh my gosh. gosh. I can't believe she fits in there. Oh, a tiny fighting. That's crazy. I got a perfect idea. Why don't you sit down and you guys have a little date night? Hey! In the vehicle. Um, this is not the official date night, okay, Chad? This doesn't count. This is just like a snack date teaser. Hey, I'm driving, okay? okay We're in England right now, so I'm driving on the right hand side. <laughs> Shout out to everybody in England who watches us. So I gotta eat this with no hands? Yeah, how are you gonna do that? Oh, it's huge! This is gonna soil my lunch. I might break my vegan diet for that one. Should I just shove this on your face? You know, I need to open this up. So glad I'm not doing this. Oh my gosh, I'm making a mess. You and Daniel's been hanging out for too long. You guys are disgusting. Ew! Man, I was full earlier, but now you're making me hungry. Mm, this is so good. You got a little something on your... Is there something on my face? Just a little bit. I got it. Okay. When we first got married, you chew a little quieter, you eat a little neater, and you didn't have facial hair. When are you gonna get that thing off? When we go on our date chat, I want you to look like your original self. Hairless. I mean... I gotta shave my head? Facial hairless! Beardless! That's what I meant. You heard her say hairless. Do you have to shave my legs too? Just hurry up. I want to find out this stalker. What information do you know about this stalker? I don't know anything about this stalker, honestly. I just woke up in the back of his car and he stole my phone. He took my skateboard, man. I missed that thing. And you weren't at the theater? I was not at the theater. It was not me. I keep trying to tell you guys. What How else? did you know he'd be here at the mall? Um, uh, well, with the whole uh, cell phone and triangular service, we were able to pinpoint his exact location right here at this mall. Who is we? No, I said me. You guys misheard because of the mall music. I said me. Yeah, yeah. But we're gonna catch this guy, and it's gonna prove my innocence. Okay. Show the camera your little uh, shaving on the side of your head there. Oh, you your little, your this little thing? fade. Yeah. This well, yeah. What's that stand for? It stands for a spy ninjas and how cool it is. No, it looks like a Z, dude. Like a Project Z. Zorgo. It's like a uh, like a M for uh, Melvin. I mean, uh, Melvana. All right, I'm just gonna. I'm not about. He's really suspicious, guys. That's clearly a Z. Oh, you're done. Nice, bro. How's your stomach feel? I got a stomach of iron. That was delish. Let's get out of here. The stalker gotta show himself somewhere, right?
Guys, V Quan here. She just recently hit 10 million subscribers a couple days ago. Yes. Thanks to you guys. So if you're not already subscribed, turn your phone up this way and underneath the video is a red subscribe button. Make sure to click it and make it turn red so you are one of those 10 million people who are subscribed to this awesome girl. Thank you, you guys make me so happy. Thank you so much for my diamond play button. It's so awesome. I can't wait to get it in the mail. Guys, we are at a loss for clues right now because we got the clue. We, uh, hopefully you guys are solving it right now. But um, we don't know what else to do, actually. I think we just keep exploring. Hopefully we run into this guy. But uh, I see something oh. right oh here. Gosh. I don't know if he notices us yet. Is he watching us? I think this situation's about to escalate. Just act normal. Don't do anything. Oh, he's going, he's going. Go, 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 go. He's trying to get away. Oh, this guy is a spy. Come on, come on, come on. It's not spy ninja trials quite yet, okay? You don't need to be rolling around the ground. I appreciate the effort, though. Okay, where'd he go? He was right here. Hey, that's him, that's him. He was right here. He's gotta be right around here. We just saw him. I'm pointing this way. Come on, do a barrel roll. I don't know if we need to do a barrel roll. Do you see him? We lost him again. He really is like a magician, like this. Hey, that's pretty good. Pretty good, I huh? I feel like if you didn't do the barrel roll, we would have caught up with him. Wait, yeah. do you still have that clue on you, V? The, the decoded yeah. message? There's a bunch of stuff behind these clues here. New ma material. Wait, I recognize this right here. Dark Horse Comics. You know I love comic books. I collect Spider-Man comics. This guy must have shopped at a comic book store in here and put this in that mannequin's pocket. There's gotta be a comic book store around here somewhere. I love comics. I love reading Harry Potter. Oh, jeez. Wait, what's that? Comics and stuff! Perfect, let's go. Whoa, comics and stuff. We're here. You guys know I love comic books. I think you have the largest comic book collection, Chad. A mask. Why are you so interested in masks, the leak? I'm not interested, it just it scared me. Interesting. Interesting. So we know that this stalker guy obviously shopped here. He ripped off a piece of paper from Dark Horse Comics. Ooh, amazing Spider-Man comics. Got it, 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 got it. I got all these comics already. Look at this t-shirt. That's George Washington. No, look at the mask. He's smiling. Look, another mask. What the heck? This is clearly the, the comic book shop of hackers right here. This is where they all go. It's kind of getting a little creepy right here, Chad. Look at this shirt. <gasps> the Joker. That symbol that the stalker uses. And that's a DC comic, right, Chad? You like Marvel Spider-Man? This guy's coming for you, Chad. Me? Yeah. He's crossing your face out, though. That's true. Hey, the leak. What do you know about Fight Club? Um, all I did was just get a text, and I was given dog tags, and I was told to show up at the park. I didn't even know I was gonna meet you guys. But why did? Oh. Let's go. It is for full, full dream. Text message from him. It says, "Let's play some games." It is, this is an arcade. Does this guy not know I'm a master gamer, especially arcade games? I'll kick his butt. We gotta keep an eye out for this guy. I can beat him at any of these games. Spy Ninjas, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite arcade game ever? Mine's the ski ball. If I were a stalker, you know where I'd be hiding? Chad? Chad? Oh, where'd he go? Okay, I'm gonna go check it out. All right, you're the bravest Spy Ninja. A little Look creepy. Where is he? Ah! Oh my gosh, this is not time to be pranking us. What? I think I see him. Follow me, follow me. Just walk casually. He's right here. Take a look. We should go and confront him, Chad. There's someone else coming. He's got a briefcase. They're making some sort of exchange. Okay, we gotta go confront this guy right now. Let's go, let's go. Hey! You got a lot of explaining to do, buddy. There's nowhere you can go. I'll tell you what you want to know. But we need to go somewhere quiet. Come with us, we'll take you somewhere quiet. All right, here's your quiet place, buddy. You got a lot of explaining to do. Yeah, man, you've been putting my name through the mud right now. You do? Have a seat. KB, this is it. It's one of these two guys. It's definitely the stalker who's been bothering us and delivering things to our house and stealing things. Yeah, let's find out right now, Chad. Let's give him the hard-hitting questions. Uh, you first. Um, are you guys... One of you! It's the stalker. Who is it? Fess up now. Fess up. Fess up. Okay. I am not the stalker. Oh. Wait, I don't have a lie detector test, so I don't oh, know if okay. he's telling the truth or not. My turn, my turn. I am not the stalker. 
We know for a fact that the stalker wears Taco Bell shirts. Very interesting. What's that? My shirt. Let's show shirts. Okay, show shirts. On three, one, two, three. <gasps> Taco Bell, Taco the Bell. link. Hold on, hold on. You set me up for this, man. Look, this is the perfect chance to see if this is the exact match. This is impossible. I'll show you guys right now. Look what? at this shirt. It's a brand new Chris White shirt with a sticker right here. I even got the tag right here. It's a fashion statement if I want to return it. Do you see any rips? Okay. Um, the only rips I see is the oh, You know what uh, I mean? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's definitely Melvin's friend. There's no hole for this to fit into, so it's not that shirt. But he can own more than one shirt, Chad. But he could also own one and just not be wearing it today. The only Taco Bell item I own are these gloves. Wait, those gloves? Those are Taco Bell gloves, you're saying? We know that the stalker has leather gloves. We saw the doggy cam, the gloves reached down from the car and picked the dog up. Ew. You smell a dog? No, I don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't touch my gloves. Why not? I don't like people seeing my hands. Do you have a dog? I'm... Why are you following us? Hurry, 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 hurry. <laughs> hey, one question at a time. Okay, first question. What question do you want? The second question. All right, question number two. Go, V. Do you own a dog? No, I mean yes. Oh. I was joking. No. If only we had Daniel here with the lie detector test, that would really help. I got an idea. I'll act like Daniel right now. Tell us where we're at. Tell us who we are. That's pretty Tell good. Us hmm. Tell us something. Hey V, we know Come that on. the stalker is a huge Spy Ninjas right fan. This Come guy on. seems to be the big Spy Ninja fan right here. No, he's been Daniel and Melvin. So let's see if this guy knows stuff about the Spy Ninjas. Okay, okay. okay the leak. That's really okay, good. Okay, that's okay, really that's good. Great. I got a question for you. Who is your favorite Spy Ninja? Uh. Melvin. <laughs> oh, okay. We gotta find out if he's a super fan. Okay, I know, I know. What are the Spy Ninja's tenants? Great food, great pizza, awesome clothing, and great times. Wow. wow. Good job, bro. Oh. So you thought he was right? Wait, Wait. you thought that was the Spy Ninja's tenants? Well, yeah, that's like the second page of it, right? The first page is obviously being a scaredy cat, uh, cheating, and, um, <laughs> and lying, right? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? I think you guys are confused with Project Zorgo's tenants. They're the cheaters. The tenants are bravery, honesty, and loyalty. So the exact opposite of what you said. Oh, sorry. My mistake. So far, the leak. He's being sus right now, Chad. And this guy right here, he doesn't know anything about the spy ninjas. Why are they so friendly right now? They're like doing patty cake or something. They look like Daniel and Regina. At first I thought this guy was scary, but not anymore. Yeah, so maybe they're both the stalkers or none of them are the stalkers. Okay, buddy, why have you been following us? Answer me now! He's been following me! The leak. How did you know that this guy would be here today? I I, I said earlier that the, the satellites, the triangular down to the cell phones because we all carry one and- You tracked his cell phone. That's right. Do you have a cell phone on you? Not at all. He's lying. He doesn't even have a cell phone He's on. lying, dude. Everyone's got a cell phone, dude. How'd you call your mom today? We did see this guy talking on the phone earlier when we first got here. You're lying. Both of you guys, I don't know. I know, 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 I know. You, you planted this straw, didn't you? In the trash can, I saw you. Fine. This straw right here. Is there a secret message on here? Hey, you know what, Chad? I think we got everything we need here. Yeah, I think you guys are both innocent. You probably are not the stalker. So, um, let's just, you know, go back to the safe house. Well, you know what, the leak? I think you should continue to interview this guy for us. Yeah, you're doing a great try, job. Just trying to figure out who he is. Okay, okay. Question number one. What is two plus two? Okay, great case. Let's open this thing up right now. Okay. Huh? It opened. The passcode was already punched in. This guy's not much of a security expert. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. A voice morpher and the new Project Zorgo mask. Is there anything else, Chad? That's it. That's all that's in here. Whoa. Whoa. It's that symbol. Okay. That guy is definitely him. Let me hit play. Did you hear that? Let me play it again. Nice try, I'm watching you. Who's watching us? We gotta go talk to that guy. Let's go, let's go talk to him real quick and see who, who gave him this. Let's go. V, they both disappeared. Where did they go? Okay, we gotta find some clues on this right here. There's gotta be more in here, V. Are there in like invisible ink or something? I just got a text message. It's a live feed. That's, That's us. us! Do I go here? Someone's filming us. That means 
Neither of those two guys were the stalker. The, the real stalker totally set us up, I think. This is just a wild duck chase. He's watching us all the time. Trench coat guy, trench coat guy. Let's, let's, let's go. go. He's in the parking lot. He's right here. He's right there. He's right here. We got him. We got him. Oh we got him. We got him. What? Hey, hey, hey. Come on. Come on, Jen. I can't even faster than a car. This guy, he's so sneaky. He gets away from everything. That was so close. He ran into the Tesla. Well, at least we got his briefcase. That was so close. What it do, Spy Ninjas? Today we're doing the last to leave the date fort challenge. We got two forts set up at the safe house. It's boys versus girls. This is the boys, boys fort boys. over here. We built this. We are never going to leave it. We are going to beat the girls. Let's go inside and never leave. Woo! This is the better girls. fort over here. Yes, this is the girls fort. Oh, yeah. We're gonna, and we're never going to leave because we're going to win. We're doing this because if you don't know, we have this weird stalker, and he told us if we do this challenge, he'll reveal who he is. Let's go, Melvin. Come on. Okay, everybody's going in their forts. I'm part of Team Boys after all. I'll go in that one. I could definitely live in this fort. Welcome to our beach oasis. Ooh. Look how cozy it is. Is this the sleeping quarters? Yes. Sleeping. Oh, sleeping. And then let me welcome you guys to the lounging area. Nice, comfy, fun playtime. Whatever this room is. What is this room called, Regina? A uh, fun time room. <laughs> it's the playroom. We got endless entertainment. Just in case we need to start war with the other team. Look at this tunnel here that leads to the boys' tents made out of light. Welcome to our date fort. Why is it called a date fort? Because we're all the boys are on one side and the girls are on the other. But right here in the tunnel, we've got a little pillow with a cart. This tunnel here leads to the girls fort. So we could sabotage them and sneak our way over there. But as we make our way further into the fort, as you can see, we've got a fridge full of food. The girls don't have that. Direct access to the freezer. Daniel, good of you to join us. I brought some musical instruments. Nice. <laughs> oh yeah! Daniel, why are these called date night forts? I know. I mean, Valentine's Day is coming up. Look at the lighting. It's so romantic. Maybe I'll invite my new girlfriend over. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Daniel's got a girlfriend? Regina's already in her fort. Uh, what are you talking about? No, at the mall that one day. I went up to some girl, asked for her phone number, and she said, oh, anything for you, and she gave it to me. That's when we were busy doing our fight club mission. I met a girl there, too. Yeah, she kicked both of our butts. Isn't that so hot? Why'd we let that happen, Melvin? I let it happen. We ain't going easy on you next time, bro. Yeah. Anyway, let's continue this tour, okay? Melvin, here you go. Show the rest of our fort, Melvin. Absolutely. This wouldn't be a dude's fort if we didn't have artillery. Just in case the girls try to launch an all-out attack, we'll be able to defend ourselves. And we have a nice visual across the living room all the way over to the girl's side. So Daniel, what happens if we win this challenge? What do we win exactly, huh? Well, we're just doing it to make the stalker happy. He's gonna reveal who he is. Yeah, I gotta figure out who this guy is. What was that? It's a video message from an unknown number. Okay, hit play. Oh, got a text. It's from the stalker. Oh, what is he saying? Let's what raise the stakes. If the girls win, Chad must shave his beard and take me on the day of her dreams. So if we leave our fort before the girls leave their fort, I have to shave and I have to take thee on a date. Yes! I don't like his beard and I want the perfect date night. I've been waiting for it for so long, you guys. But if the boys win, Jack gets to keep his beard and V must take Chad to Taco Bell for the date of his dreams. I don't want to go to Taco Bell. We go there every day. Woo! Oh, I like the sound of that. Now that's a Valentine's Day. We are never leaving, and I am never shaving, and we're gonna go to Taco Bell. We gotta make these girls lose. How are we gonna do it? Well, look how comfortable our fort is. Why would we ever leave? I wish our Spy Ninja fans could be hanging out here with us. That'd be fun. I wish my new girlfriend could be hanging out here. Ooh, you should give her a call, Daniel. A call? Yeah. Let's sneak away to the boys' tent. We'll see if we can hear any of their plans, and then we'll sabotage it. And we can also see what the heck Daniel's talking about with his girlfriend. Yeah. Has he called her yet? I don't know why he's calling her her girlfriend when they haven't even met. He's so weird. 2021 Daniel is very questionable. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Let's go through the tunnel. You have experience crawling through tunnels before, right? Yeah, I'm not as good as you, though. Okay, oh. let's go. Let's 
I'm not sure this place is cozy, but there's a tunnel system. What if we just sabotage them? Make them leave first. I got it. I'm gonna start eating and start building up the worst fart I ever could. Hey, Melvin, making our way to the fridge. What kind of food makes you toot? We need to craft all the items that would make the most disgusting fart. And spicy hot V8 is a good base. That's true. A tub of ranch. Oh, nice. There's whipped cream up there. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, extra creamy dairy whip topping. Oh, yeah, that'll make you too. Fantastic. Cheese. So a nice combination of spice and dairy. And then we'll send them the fart there. You can turn that into a wrap. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tell the girls they shouldn't try to escape fate Cause we about to hit them with a dose of B8 With a little bit of pepper jack cheese I'm gonna fart and they're gonna say Please, no, don't hit me <laughs> Let's eat You know V, we're making our way to the fridge Oh, we didn't, we forgot to prepare food Oh, let's try and take some Cause we need to last longer than the boys I'm not eating any more Taco Bell Where were you, Daniel? You were looking at your phone, weren't you? No Yeah, you were thinking about making a phone call It's too too soon to call my girlfriend, not- What do you mean it's too soon? Is there some sort of three-day rule you're talking about? Yeah, but I blew it. I was supposed to call her yesterday. Blew it, man. No Daniel, more girlfriend for you. Daniel in love. Why are you so in love, Daniel? Hey, I'm- Oh, my- Ew. Ew. <laughs> This is a uh... whipped cream and pepper jack. It's all I need for the girls to get back. Ew. Mmm. Yucky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I do invite my girlfriend over, yeah. you better hold in the farts. What's her name, anyways? Yeah, what's her name? My girlfriend? Yeah. Regina, I can hear Daniel talking about his girlfriend. Oh, listen, listen. Okay. Well, she's not really my girlfriend yet, but okay. soon to be. Does that answer your question? No, what's her name, Daniel? My uh, name? You're so silly. My name is Daniel Gizmo. Wow. What's her name? I, I, I've only talked to her that one time at the mall. I got her number and that was it. So I, you're saying you don't know her name? He doesn't even know her name. What the heck? He's calling her her girlfriend? He doesn't even know her name? Do you even have her, like, Instagram tag or something? Uh, I think I'm gonna call her in this video. Hmm. He's gonna call her in this video. What? Should we just go over there and just set this thing straight? Yeah, let's, let's do it. Okay. Guys, for we got fun over here. We could do this all day. Well, something is. What's going on over here? Should we? Hey. Should we oh. Hey, this is what the boys. The, hey. You're entering the boys' zone. We got lots of dairy, V. Back up. Say goodbye. They got dairy, Regina. Oh, I no. think this is for you. That's one of your weaknesses. Yeah. I'm coming through. Okay. We're here to confront you, Daniel. What did I Watch do? Watch out, I got cheese. Oh. Hey. Back up, back Please, up. Don't touch V with that. Don't. Guys, don't break this fort. It has to look super beautiful when my girlfriend comes over. Zoe, why are you mad at Daniel? Why are you calling this girl your girlfriend? What is oh, her name? You Do you even know anything about her? Are you guys spying on us? What the heck? We were having a private conversation that didn't include the two of you. Well, we heard everything. Uh, Sorry, have you ever heard of the ninja noise enhancer? Oh, It works. Yes. And we heard you were talking about your girlfriend. She's coming over? You're hey. calling her? She's not my girlfriend yet, but once she comes here... Well, he hasn't even called her yet. I'll call her right now. Yeah? Do it. You're probably even lying about all this. You're just trying to make somebody no, jealous. No, no, no. You guys were there. You saw. Hey, I'm going to call her right now. God, I don't think Daniel even has a girlfriend. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't know her name. We just met her the other day, and we said like two sentences to her. Are you hitting her up on the DM. No, I'm just Daniel? nervous. This is my first time talking to her. Hey, hey, hey! hey. Oh, my phone! Oh, oh, hey, what the heck? Good luck, hey. Daniel. <laughs> my phone. I can't call my girlfriend. Well, you better do something about it. They'll probably call her for you. <sighs> Come on, Regina. Let's go. Whoa! That's so fun! Yes! <laughs> and I got the phone. We should call her first. Okay. He already dialed in the number. Let me call her. Maybe it's a fake number. <laughs> that way it should be perfect. I know! Maybe she won't pick up. Hello? Um, hello? Hi. I'm, I am Daniel's friend. Uh, Daniel, this is Daniel's friend? Yeah, um, Daniel, the guy that you met at the mall. Um, hi. I am here to tell you, if you're gonna go on a date with Daniel, you should be warned that, you know, he has a, um, uh, foot problem. Don't feel sorry for him, I just need you to know that every night before he sleeps, he needs you to rub the ointment in between his toes. I'm just warning you about your future. Oh, that doesn't sound too bad, I don't really mind at all. What? This girl's like feet? She likes feet? 
she likes gross things? Oh no, oh, man, perfect we're, for Daniel. We're in trouble, Regina. Oh, wait, wait, you wait. come up with something. Okay, okay. Um, you know what? The ointment also helps with this weird scent that he has in between the toes. Ugh, Ugh. It smells like sauerkraut. You can put it on top of hot dogs and stuff. That stuff is so good. Oh, it's gonna make me hungry. We should have it on our date. <gasps> okay, Melvin, it's time. We are gonna head through the tunnel to the girl's fart. The closer we can get, the more pungent it's gonna be. Can you even make it? Wait, Chad, what? We're in the wrong configuration. What do you mean? You're gonna be in the way of my fart. We gotta switch places. Oh gosh. All right, how do you do this? We gotta get close. Yeah. Daniel, gotta... change positions. I gotta come over there. Oh gosh. No. Oh jeez. Yeah. yeah, crawl under me, Melvin. Yeah, Don't do it. Yeah, yeah. Here we go, I'm okay. a bridge. Wow. Daniel, crawl through. Okay. Yeah, yeah, good job. Okay. I can't turn around now. Chad. I'll have to come this way. Ah! <laughs> ah! I got one more thing. Oh, okay. Uh, hey, it's me again. Uh, also, you should know that Daniel is likes going uh, dumpster diving. It's one of his favorite things to do. You know, you can actually find a lot of cool stuff if you do that. I can see why he likes to dumpster dive. Maybe he'll go with me sometime on a date. Just, let's just, we'll call you back later, okay? Okay, uh, bye. Yeah, just stay away. She's perfect for him. No, she's not. No, don't say that. Let's not focus on Daniel anymore. Let's not even like Daniel. Yeah, let's do it. We gotta win this, yeah. and then I'll bring you on my date. Must avoid and then I'll ask Chad to bring Daniel on our date. You do that for me? Yeah, so if we win this, Chad and I will go on a date. But I'll just ask Chad, you know, bring bring a friend along. Daniel won't even notice. We're, we're gonna be double dating! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, me! Yeah. Oh no, Regina sees you. Well, she's gonna smell me real soon, too. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta, I gotta release it, Daniel! Ready? No! Oh! Oh! Ow! Melvin, get out of here! Go on with that, but he can't get out! He's stuck! Ah! Get out! You're shooting, Regina! Ouch! You're shooting me! Ouch! That hurts! Ouch! Retreat! Ow! My butt! Yeah! Ouch! Get out of here! Melvin, did you get my phone while you were down there? What? Were we supposed to do that? Oh, she you should have. stole Daniel's phone. I'm never gonna be able to call my girl. Daniel, we gotta go back and get your phone, man. How are we supposed to call your girlfriend? Daniel, I got an idea. While we were crawling along the way, they had a little cart in the middle. We attached this rope. Ooh. Maybe we can use this as some kind of pulley system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll tie it around you, and then you'll sneak your way down to grab the phone. And then to retreat quickly, we'll pull you up. Yeah. And we'll reel you in. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so they're probably gonna try and come over here and get this back so Dan can call his girlfriend. We should use this against them. Oh, I got the voice morpher. We already know what her voice sounds like because yeah. we already talked to her. We should pretend that we're her. Yeah. And lure Daniel over here. And then we toss the phone outside of the tent. And that will get him out because he's going to want to talk to her so badly. Yeah. Uh, so did they call her over there? I don't know. I, I think they might have called her. Who knows what they would have said. They probably said a bunch of really embarrassing things. She's probably not your girlfriend anymore. Uh, I'm going to get my phone back and then call her and, and explain everything. You know what? I have an idea. Look what we have in our fort. Look. What is it? It's a grabber. You wheel me close enough where they don't see me. And then I will sneak in. Oop, got the phone. Okay, come on, Daniel, you got this. Let me record a message as his girlfriend. Hey, Daniel. Um, I miss you, boo. Ew. Babe. Ew. When are we gonna hang out? <laughs> Do you think that's good? I, I think that's good. I, I was very appalled by that, so <laughs> maybe Daniel would too. Yeah, yeah. I'll pitch it up. I'm gonna get that phone back. We're gonna make the girls lose. I can see them. There they are, right there. Where's my phone? Right there. Guys, get ready to pull me. I got him. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna put the phone in my pocket. Okay, guys, I'm on the pulley system. Pull! <laughs> What's up, Louis? What's up, Louis? Daniel! He's bringing our tunnel! Ah! My leg! It's okay! Keep pulling! Keep pulling! 
Yes. We did it! We did it! Yeah. It, it worked! Yeah. You did it, Daniel! Daniel was trying to come over here and steal his phone! But guess what, Daniel? We still got your phone! He just got the case! Good pulling, guys! We might have broke the tunnel, but our fort's still intact. Yes, I got the phone right here! Time to call my girlfriend. Let's give her a call. What? Daniel! This is the phone case! Daniel! Your what? Phone, your phone must have fallen no. out! Or they tr freaking tricked me! No. They probably still have my phone! Daniel, how are we supposed to call your girlfriend now? Let's just face it, I'm gonna be single forever. No, Daniel, I'm not gonna let that happen. Hey, we, we're next to the fridge, right? Yeah. They're gonna get thirsty eventually. Yeah. So we, you know, we're nice. We're like, here's some water. Little do they know, they'll have to use the bathroom. Leave the fort. You know what I mean? That's a great idea. Here he is. It's Diet Mountain Dew. That's what girls like. I'll deliver this. Yeah. Yeah, it's your turn, Chad. Daniel is so desperate to call his girl friend. The only way he can call her is if he can get his phone. Yeah. He left his little claw there. Let's take, take it. it. Yeah. Oh, he broke the freaking tunnel. What? Look at this. Oh my gosh, he broke it. Wait, they're coming. They're coming. I work my way over. I hear some sneaky voices. Hey, what are you doing in my tunnel? Get out of here. I came to make a special delivery, so I brought a little treat. Aww. I brought you a Diet Mountain Dew. Oh, thanks, Chad. Enjoy it. Why are you looking like that, Regina? No one brought me a Mountain Dew. What do you want to drink, Regina? Do they have some, um, cranberry juice? Regina wants some cranberry stuffing. Stuffing? Cra Thanksgiving cranberry stuffing. Oh, okay. Wait, what are you whispering about? No, nothing. What are you, what are you whispering about? Oh, you should go back and get that cranberry stuffing for me, Chad. I thought you wanted cranberry juice. Oh, yeah, the juice. Yeah, whatever. Just bring something back. Something. I'm wheeling myself back. Wee! That was so sweet of Chad to bring me a drink. I know. He is a good husband. Even if we're on separate teams, he's still thinking about you. Melvin, I need a drink to give to Chad to make Regina pee. How about this big old thing of 78X? Come with me. Melvin, you gotta come up here, too. Let's go. Follow Chad. I'm gonna deliver this on the cart. Once I get down there, I'll give it a tug tug. That means you guys pull me back. Oh, I think the message is playing. Wait, what's that noise? What's that noise? Mm -mm. Hey, Daniel. I miss you. It's me, your girlfriend. That's my girl. Wait, I, it's, it's coming from the phone, your I think. Phone, they, she must have left you a voicemail on your phone. Where is it coming from? It's like right here. Hello? Hey, it's, it's, it's me, Daniel. He's responding to it. <laughs> He doesn't know what a voicemail is. I can't wait to meet you in real life. Can you call me back so we can set up a date? Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, I don't have my phone right now, though. I'm sorry. I, I... Daniel, it's a voicemail. You can't talk to a voicemail. <laughs> I can't hear you. I gotta get this freaking phone, Chad. Let me deliver this. I'll look for the phone, and I'll bring it back, and you can call her. Yeah, yeah, she's still interested in me. Regina didn't embarrass me that much. Hurry, no, before it's too late. Special delivery, special delivery. Hey, yeah. hello, ladies. Wait, Here's wait. Regina's cranberry juice. Oh, it's cream. blue. Oh, wait. wow. I've never seen your fort. It's awesome, isn't it? Yeah, let me just look around a little bit. You better tell uh, Daniel if he wants to call his girlfriend back. He has to get his phone. Oh, I see. They sent him over here as a sneak. No. To steal the phone. I away. came to deliver the cranberry juice. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the cranberry juice. You can leave now. Okay. They're protecting it really well. We gotta come up with a backup plan. Escape! 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 Ah! Guys, I almost got Daniel's phone. Regina has it in her hands. Daniel, you gotta go get your phone, man. Okay. Yeah, I would do anything. For this girl. I'm getting my phone back. I'm going in. I can't ruin my relationship with this girl. It's a treacherous mystery. Here we go. Oh, he's coming. Oh, 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 wow. I came to get my phone. I came to call my girlfriend. You're trying to not make me fall in love, huh? No. You want me to be single for the rest of my life? This is my phone. Uh, give it to me. We talked to your girlfriend, actually. Yeah, we, we told her about your ointment. Your foot ointment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Did she, what did she say? Well, you should call her did back. Did she say P.U.? You should call her back. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, prepare yourself. Hello? Hey, uh, it's me, Daniel. Sorry. How are you? Yeah, you want your phone? Go take it! Oh, hey! Guys, they just threw my phone! It's outside of the fort! You want to talk to your girlfriend? You gotta go outside of the fort! You guys are jerks! Oh, you you want to get your phone? Oh, sorry. I, we got your little pinches! Hey! Little pinches! Get ah! out! Just get out of the tent and just lose already! Get I'm gonna get you guys back. Get out of here! Guys, red alert, red alert! My phone's outside the house! The girls threw Daniel's phone out of the forts. It's not that far away. Oh, it's so close. It's right there. How do we get it without leaving the fort and losing the challenge? 
Good thing we're here by the kitchen. Maybe there's some utensils we can make. Daniel, oh. they took the phone. I know, we've got a plan already. Really? Check this out. We're gonna take the clear tape. We're gonna create a loop like this. We got this rope. Tie a little knot. We throw this. Ooh. If it lands on the phone, we can pull the phone back. That's great, man. That's great. All right, here we go. Yes! It's so oh, good. Chad. Nice, Chad. Oh, Regina. What? A problem. I've been drinking Chad's Mountain Dew. I have to go tinkle soon. Oh, no. V, come on. But I I didn't want to, you know, be rude. And Chad did such a nice thing. And... No, 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 no. They set us up. Chad did this for a reason. What the heck? What do I do now? We can't leave the tent. Well, did Dale get his phone? Maybe he left the fort. Let's see. Check over here. Here we go. I got to pull up real gently. Oh, no! Can you reach it now? Reach it's it close now. enough. Yeah, I'm trying to reach through. Luckily, I'm Chad well played with super long arms. Hold on to my feet, Melvin. Uh, yes, I got it. Oh, no, they got the phone! Oh, no! Hey! Oh, hey! Fire! Yes! Yes, we got the phone! Yes! We need to defend ourselves! Yeah! He retreated back into the fort! Hi! Oh, no! Oh boy, Chad! Phone. Nice! You go call that girl! Oh no! They got their phone back! No! Oh, okay, V, 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 focus. What? Oh gosh. Focus, V. What do I Don't do? think about water and waterfalls and rain. Uh, think That's about... the opposite. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh, I got something. I got what? something. What? Too. What? Hurry. Ew. <laughs> no, Regina. You've been hanging around with Daniel too much, thinking about these girl stuff. No. Do you think I was supposed to go in here? Okay, Daniel, oh call her. Gosh. I'm so nervous. You're nervous? Don't be nervous. Put it on speaker, though, Ready? so I know it's real. Hello? <laughs> uh... Hey, it's Daniel. Oh, the guy from the mall. Right? Yeah, yeah, I'm the guy who went up to you and said, can I have your phone number? And you gave it to me. I and remember you. How's yeah. it going? Good. How's it going with you? Uh, it's, going, it's going good. Thanks for uh, giving me a call. Maybe one day we could go get some food together or something. Yes. Uh, sure. Ask her what she's doing for Valentine's Day. What are you doing for Valentine's Day? February 14th, 2021. What was that? I said I'm free. And Daniel, invite her over to our safe house. It's too soon. I, I just called her for the first time. Tell her you can't wait to see her again. So it's a date on Valentine's Day? Why don't you just invite her over right now? This is going so well, Daniel. She thinks you're cute. You think she's beautiful. Invite her over here right now. Oh, I, I, listen, I know I said that, but I just don't want to. Hey, uh, Bay, I'm, I'm going to have to call you back. Oh, okay. Um, all right, talk to you later. Okay, um, miss you. Bye. Uh, we're so awkward, Daniel. I don't know how to talk to a girl. Uh, you guys gotta give me tips on how to talk to beautiful women. Baby, baby. Okay, no, no, no. We can do this. Come on, I need to go. We need to go. We, we have to win. We need a plan. Girl. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, v, you have a husband. Yes. He's supposed to protect you and yes. keep you safe when yes. you're in danger. Yes. And you are um, definitely in danger right yes. now. Why don't we set up a plan to where we pretend that you're in danger so Chad has to bust through his fort to save you. Okay, sounds good. Whatever you say, just hurry. Okay, okay. Wait, okay pretend I'm hurting you. Ow! Ah, Chad, help! Do you hear that? What's going on? V needs my help. It's my duty as a husband to save my wife. This challenge is over. Wait, no, Chad, wait, wait a second. Probably a trick or something. No. Oh. I'm coming for you, V. Ah. Hey. Ah. I'm coming for ah. you. I'm coming, V. What is happening? Come on. I'm here for you, V. What's wrong? Uh, What's wrong? I need you to carry me out of this tent right now and straight into the bathroom. That's what a husband's for, V. Here we go. I got you, V. Thank you. To the bathroom. <laughs> And the greatest husband award goes to Chad Wildley! Why are you looking at me like that? You really did that, Chad! Do you understand what you just did, Chad? Oh, well, that means the boys lose! Oh. You're gonna shave your beard and take V on a fancy, expensive date. No Taco Bell for you. Hey, V's back. Uh, I you. feel such a light, airy person. Okay, all right, stalker. The boys lost. Big whoop. You have to reveal who you are. Oh, gosh. Oh, there Ooh. he is. Another video text. So, you want to know who I am? Yes. Well, here's a hint. I was at Chad V's wedding. What? 
What? Wedding. What? This guy's been a fan of you guys for that long? That was years and years ago. We had like 200 people at that wedding. Okay, well that's a pretty big clue. That's a good clue. We're getting closer to finding out who the stalker guy is. Stalker, we're gonna find you. 